Hello, and welcome to this month's BCR coding break. For today's topic, we will talk about the lesser use ablation and embolization treatments. Under ablation, we will discuss thermal, laser, and cryoablation. Under embolization, we will discuss chemoembolization and radioembolization. Types of thermal um, ablation include radiofrequency ablation and microwave ablation. These treatments are used for image guidance and treat energy to destroy, I'm sorry, heat energy to destroy the tumor. Radiofrequency ablation uses high frequency electrical current passed through an electrode in the needle that creates a small region of heat. Microwave ablation uses electromagnetic waves to create heat around the needle, so it also creates a small region of heat. This heat created from both procedures destroys the tumor and closes blood vessels and lessens the risk of bleeding. Laser ablation is a type of treatment using heat or focused light to shrink or destroy a tumor. It is less invasive alternative to traditional surgical resection. This type of therapy offers little to no scarring. It's less painful with typically a quicker recovery than a surgical resection. Laser ablation can treat cancer that has spread to the lungs, some small head and neck cancers, and tumors in the brain. It can also be used for colon polyp and free cancer in the cervix. Cryoablation or cryosurgery is a treatment that uses extreme cold created by liquid nitrogen, which freezes the tissue. When the frozen tissue thaws, the treated area of tissue cells die. This is often done with local anesthesia and can be repeated safely. Cryoablation is chosen sometimes as an option when a tumor can't be surgically removed or the patient can't have surgery due to other health problems. It is used to treat cancers of skin, early stage prostate, liver, bone and lung, etc. And it is used also for the studied use with other cancer treatments. Chemoembolization is a procedure that injects substances directly into an artery to block or reduce the blood flow to a tumor. This allows a higher concentration of drug to be in contact with the tumor for a longer period of time. This is an option for some tumors that cannot be resected or metastatic tumors. We code this chemotherapy treatment when chemo drugs are given or when the term chemoembolization is used with no reference to any chemo drug. Once treatment is completed, an MRI or CT scan is usually performed several weeks later to determine if there is a reduction in size. Next, we will talk about radioembolization. This type of treatment combines embolization and radiation therapy together. This procedure injects tiny beads called microspheres coated with Y90 into the artery. When external beam radiation therapy generates beams from a machine and are directed at the tumor outside of the body, radioembolization is a type of procedure that does the work inside of the body. The beads are lodged in the blood vessels near the tumor and give off small amounts of radiation for several days. This is an option for tumors that cannot be treated with other types of treatments, such as surgery or liver transplant. For cases diagnosed prior to 1-1-2018, these treatments were coded to brachytherapy. Now, for cases diagnosed on or after 1-1-2018, we will use code 13 radioisotope for the radiation modality and code 88 for the planning technique. Here is a case example with a kidney primary. Patient receives a renal ultrasound on 7-13-21, 7-31-21. 
that shows a 2.9 centimeter mass in left kidney. The 9-15-21 kidney biopsy was performed and showed a clear cell carcinoma, grade two. And the 10-24-21 microablation procedure was not associated with any pathology report. The information was located within the scans portion of the EMR. In the store manual 2021, Appendix A, site-specific surgery code, we see codes for surgical events with no specimen sent to pathology in codes 10 to 15, and other surgical events with pathology reports accompanied, such as code 30 for partial nephrectomy. Microwave ablation is a form of thermal ablation used in interventional radiology. We use code 15 due to microwave ablation performed on the kidney, and there was no pathology report associated. Our second case example shows a 73121 chest x ray that shows a 2.8 centimeter mass in the left lower lobe. 8421 chest CT also showed the left lower lobe tumor with no lymph nodes seen as involved. The 8-15-21 pulmonary consult states that the patient was evaluated and the patient was not a surgical candidate. Prior ablation is recommended. 8-26-21 operative report shows a cryosurgery was performed and no pathology report is associated with this procedure. We will use surgical code 12 from the store manual, lung surgery code. We would also use this code if cryoablation or cryotherapy terms were used. The third case example starts with a 9-22-21 PET scan that shows abnormal metabolic activity corresponding to the body and proximal tail of the pancreas at the site of the masses and is concerning for a primary pancreatic malignancy with hepatic mess. On 9-23-21, a needle core biopsy of the liver lesion was performed and came back as adenocarcinoma with a comment that says findings are compatible with pancreatic biliary primary. 10 6 hospital summary states advanced pancreatic cancer and the patient received transarterial chemoembolization embolization using cisplatin and doxorubicin. We see that the patient had pancreatic cancer with liver mess and received transarterial chemoembolization using cisplatin and doxorubicin. The abbreviation for transarterial is PACE, E A C E. The store manual tells us to code chemotherapy when the embolizing agents are chemo drugs. So we will code the first course treatment to chemo code 03 for multiple agents. I have a few tips to share. When there is no pathology or operative report associated, many times the ablation and embolization procedures will be documented along the scans portion of the EMR. Sometimes there are combination codes available, such as a kidney laser ablation is code 15 with no pathology report. However, code 24 is for a local tumor excision plus laser ablation. If you have a liver primary and a microwave ablation was performed, this is coded to 16 as this is a synonym for RFA or heat radio frequency ablation. Also code chemotherapy, I'm sorry, also code chemoembolization. When the term chemoembolization is used, even without any information provided on the type of regimen or chemotherapy drug given. So thank you for joining us today.